Is HDFS a data lake? The shocking truth about Hadoop. Is HDFS a data lake? The short answer is no, it's not a data lake. The long answer, HDFS is often used to create data lakes. It can be used as a data lake, but it is not a data lake itself. A data lake is a type of architecture. It can be composed of one or more Hadoop clusters. It doesn't necessarily have to use Hadoop. They very often are built on top of Hadoop. They also can include multiple other technologies at the same time. Other technologies used might include Amazon S3. Data lakes. They store a variety of data types. Very little, if any, pre-processing. There's a lot more you could say about data lakes. Um, a data lake is generally less rigid than a data warehouse. With a data lake, you don't generally need to pick out a schema ahead of time. It is a large system that can contain huge amounts of data. Uh, this data can come in many different forms and can be organized or structured in many different ways. It can be composed of structured data like uh, data like a data like a database, um, semi-structured data like CSV files or just raw data. Uh, this is exactly the type of thing that HDFS is meant for. Um, data lakes tend to go together with Hadoop. Um, what else? So compared to data warehouses, data lakes are supposed to be more flexible, less expensive. Data lakes are meant to make things easier than they would be with a data warehouse. They aren't a magical solution and do need to be implemented properly. Planning is critical. They do need the, the right tools in place to make them accessible to end users. It is also important to not simply treat them as data warehouses. Yeah, so it, there are cases where they're implemented but the right tools aren't in place. They're not accessible to the end users. They end up not getting used and basically being wasted. You don't want them to go to waste, so there's that. Also, they could be a huge failure if you don't plan ahead of time. They don't just magically work and solve all your problems. You still have to plan them ahead of time. They have plenty of benefits over data warehouses, just you do need to plan like anything, especially something incredibly huge like a data lake. Hadoop versus data lake. Essentially, it doesn't really make sense to compare Hadoop to a data lake. It isn't an apples to apples comparison. Um, it's more like an apples to fruit basket comparison. A data lake is generally built using Hadoop and other technologies all working together. So you could think of Hadoop as the apples and a data lake as a basket of fruit. A basket of fruit doesn't always contain apples, but it usually does. A basket of fruit could contain a single apple or multiple apples, just like a data lake might contain a single Hadoop cluster or multiple Hadoop clusters. To extend the analogy, you could think of Amazon S3 object storage as the bananas. And that's, that's pretty much it, Hadoop versus data lake. Is Hadoop a data lake? Not really, but it's used for data lakes. Now you know. If you found this informative, um, feel free to like this video, give me a nice thumbs up. Um, feel free to subscribe to my channel. Most of my videos are more interesting than this one. If you have any comments, criticism, I wanna hear it all. Leave a comment down in the, in the comments. Tell me what you liked, tell me what you didn't like. Anything you wanna say, I wanna hear it. Also, um, click the little bell if you wanna get notifications when new videos come out. Chances are, I have an even more interesting video for you to watch that you should probably, uh, that you'd probably like to, to hear about.